This is Shelley Kraft coming to you live on SNN Live. We're at the New Orleans Investment Conference 2016. I have with me Derek Iwanaka of First Mining Finance. It's a publicly traded company. I'll give you two symbols, FF on the TSX Venture, FFMGF in the U.S. Derek, welcome to SNN Live. Thank you very much, Shelley. Thanks for having me on. It's good to have you. Let's start with an overview on FIRST. On FIRST Mining Finance. So the overview is uh, the company was started by a man named Keith Newmeyer. Some of you might be familiar with him. He started a company called FIRST Majestic Silver. It's uh, close to now a $2 billion market capitalized company. Uh, he started in a time when nobody wanted silver assets in Mexico in the early 2000s. He turned that company now into a multi-billion dollar company, which is the second largest producer of silver in one of the largest uh, producing uh, countries in the world for silver. And what he wanted to do with First Mining was to look at gold projects specifically. We can get into almost any mineral, but gold is what he's most specifically after. And so we looked around last year and the market was absolutely decimated for mining equities. And so we went out and started acquiring some of these assets. There were a lot of companies that said that they wanted to do the same thing, take advantage of the bad bear market. And not very many of them were able to do it. I think we were able to execute um, probably the best out of all of them. We acquired uh, 12 projects in eight transactions. It's uh, probably an unprecedented rate to uh, do it that quickly. We are doing almost an acquisition every two months. Uh, I've never been that busy in my life, uh, in my career actually. So uh, it was a busy time. Once we have these assets, we will move them forward, enhance them. We will drill some of those projects and eventually we'll have uh, either an intermediate or a major producer come take those projects off our hands, move them into production, we would hold on to residual interests in the form of either a royalty, a metal stream, or minority interest. And that's how we monetize them. How would you categorize first mining finance? Well, we're a mineral bank company, so I don't think that we actually have a real peer group. There's no other company that's doing what we're doing. And how do you define it? Do you, what are you actually acquiring, uh, just so I understand? We're acquiring hard assets, so we're buying projects, we're buying underlying projects. In some cases, we, well actually in most cases, we actually bought the companies outright, but what we're really after is the fundamental assets or the underlying assets of those companies. So how many millions of ounces do you own? Well, uh, in measured and indicated, we have six and a half million ounces. We have three and a half million ounces in inferred. What we want to do is drill up some of those projects, bring more of those inferred ounces into a measured and indicated. And the measured and indicated ounces, we want to increase by doing additional drilling as well. So we'll have a new resource report coming out um, on one of our projects called Golden, probably done in the next three weeks. And then after that, we should have some additional estimates coming out as we drill some of these other projects. Now, we interviewed Patrick at Sprott in August. July. July. Yes. Sorry. What have we heard? Anything new happened since then? Well, since then, the market's really changed. Uh, the, the commodities, the equity market in general has improved quite significantly. What we were able to do last year and uh, the beginning of this year is just impossible now. You can't buy ounces for under $10 anymore. So... We are looking, in, uh, looking internally to grow organically, so we're going to drill these projects, move them up to the next stage. Um, we'd love to have picked up a few more assets, but unfortunately they just got away from us because of the higher metal prices. So where do you think the company is going to end up, tell me what you can, in terms of the end by the end of 2017? Well, what the goal is, is to move these projects up. Some of them will go to a resource stage. Some of them will move to a preliminary economic assessment stage. Possibly even move some of them to a pre-fee stage. But um, the objective is to risk them, get them to a stage where they're de-risked, and that an intermediate or a senior would be more inclined to want to pay additional funds to buy these things. You know what? Let's get your website out there for more information, if you would. Okay. It's www.firstminingfinance.com. We're actually making a new website right now. It should be ready, I hope, in the next month or so. Ladies and gentlemen, Derek Iwanaka, First Mining Finance. It's a publicly traded company. I'm going to give you two symbols, FF on the TSX Venture, FFMGF in the U.S., I'm Shelley Kraft. This is SNN Live, and we're coming to you live from the New Orleans Investment Conference in 2016. Derek, thanks for coming on. Thank you, Shelley. You got it, bud. Thanks.